Hi, I'm Heather and I blog over at faithtakesflight.com about our family's RV adventures, uh, living full time in an RV while traveling around the United States. Today I wanted to give you some insight into how we all share one bathroom as a family of six. So here are our dirty little secrets. So if you're going to be in the bathroom for a while, first of all we make a general announcement to the family saying something like, I'm going to be in the bathroom for a while. If anyone needs to get in real quick, now would be a good time. So that's kind of their last call to quick get in and get out. So then next we come in and if we're tall enough um, or we might ask for help, we open up the top um, screen and turn on the fan, which is kind of loud. So I'll leave that off um, while I'm videoing. Then to help keep the toilet cleaner or easier to clean, um, we discovered by reading online, and yes, this is something I actually Googled, how to keep your RV toilet cleaner or something like that. We put an X of toilet paper in the toilet first before we sit down, and that helps keep everything contained and easily flushable without making as big of a mess in the bowl because RV toilets don't flush with quite the same amount of water power as regular toilets. And also discovered that having a water bottle like this um, on hand near the toilet would be helpful because when you flush, sometimes the water doesn't reach all the way around to the front and get toilet paper that might have been dropped in the front area of the bowl as easily. So when we're flushing, if we need to give a little extra power to where we need it, we can use this and that can help clean the bowl as well. So we just kind of keep that handy and refill as necessary. So there you have it. Maybe a tip that would be helpful for you and your family or just a curiosity factor for how do people do that in an RV. Thanks and don't forget to visit us and follow our journey at faithtakesflight.com.